Hello everyone, I'm Herr Mokalover, and thank you for joining me here with Germany, leading the Central European Alliance. We're looking pretty darn large, not gonna lie. Looking pretty good. Of course, last time we started really destroying some of the Italians. We had some issues on the front line against the common turn over here, but, you know, things happen. Right now we're trying to break across to get to buy gauze... Exactly. And, uh, yeah. Trying to make a tiny, tiny encirclement. Also, my commenters, you great audience members, uh, I forgot about Norway and Sweden, and actually they pushed in just a, just a wee bit in the north. And there's a lot of divisions traveling up north, so I really don't want to send supplies up there. It's not like I can really build air bases either, so. Uh, speaking of air, how is our air power? We have no fighters in reserve. Well, we could use naval uh, carrier fighters. But, how about we don't do that? Oh, you guys need some some bad boys on yourself. Yeah, uh, let's go ahead and finish off Yugoslavia, if possible. Um, where are you all? Y'all are doing okay. Any sort of upgrades? Doesn't appear to be so, that's okay. I just want you to go right on ahead. Over here, Italy... We're doing all right. We'll just keep moving up, which is nice. We have some Coast Guard divisions being made, which is nice. We need some more tanks. Oh, we need a lot more artillery. Holy cow. But let that time go on. Last time, Prussia was cut off land-wise from us, which was good. And now we're at war with... Finally. Finally, we're at war with the Republican Spanish. I'm also joining here by, with my cat, though, Herr Binky, as he's exploring all the places on my bed and you just just jumped off and that's okay cool we won't need a ton of coast guards for this campaign but it's always good to have them nonetheless all right me you all right thank you you okay uh binky would you like to use rommel kesselring or as you von kleist why not um uh, that one that one good just do that stuff just in case for now Königsberg would need that too Oh, that's going to be a lot. Italy's definitely going to need it. Venice is definitely going to need it. Pretty much anywhere near the Adriatic. Zara. Yeah, that's as much as we're probably going to do. Oh. Hello. Italy. Three divisions. Nice. Come on, Vink. Um, so, yeah. Let's continue to try to cut these guys off. The, the name of the game is... Encirclements. Well, the name of the game really is Hearts of Iron 4, but the name of the game is Encirclements. Uh, move one of you guys up if you can. Your speed probably isn't very good. One kilometer. Sorry, I still don't want to go to war with Japan. Not really sorry, though. If I told you to move, what's your speed? Oh, you're even faster. Nice. Yeah, don't get encircled. Just hold on to there, guys. And as long as we can hold and we can move up, that's all that really matters. Because we do have a deficit of tanks right now. Um, get that artillery division in there or something. At least move, move, move. Um, anything else? Kurt Student? No, not much else. Well, regardless, I hope you're having a great guy. Great guys? No, I hope you're having a great day, everyone. Hope you're having a great day. Ooh. Oh, we have you as well. I forgot about you guys. You guys can help. Wow, look at this thrust that they're trying to push against us. Wowzers. Where are you guys? Located. Um, you know what? You guys come down here. Help out Italy. I don't want to separate generals from where they're supposed to be with other generals and field marshals. They probably won't get any action down there, and that's okay with me. Nice. Good. Ah, oh, they made the encirclement. I want these guys to starve a little bit, so when I attack them, our losses aren't too much. Alright, that's enough time for waiting. Ah, send the tanks in too. That'll help crush them a little bit faster. Good, good, good. Ah, beautiful. And don't even move. You don't need to move. Uh, I will move the tanks, however, somewhere else. Wherever I can exploit the line, I, sh I will. Which means I'm probably going to come right there. Attack here. Then move down to here. And then maybe get to Breslau. Small encirclements. Small, small encirclements. But we must watch out for... Oh. Okay. Not bad, guys. Pretty good. If you attack, odds are you won't win. Right, Bink? You're doing okay? 
I don't want to try and attack. I don't... Okay. You guys are doing alright. Norway, no thanks. Ooh, convoy is sunk. Good. Wait, who's this? Oh, Denmark. Danish Balearic Islands. Interesting. Get some of my tanks down this way. We did break through the mountains, which is kind of nice. That's actually not too easy to do. If I attack with these four divisions, can they break how many... Whoever's down here? Probably not. Yeah, probably not. They have three divisions. We do have air superiority. We might... Oh, okay. Maybe we can break through. If we can push through the Pyrenees Mountains range, that would be great. But we must, must, must watch our oil supplies. Ah, the Italian Union has given up. There is the second fall of Italy. Good. Do that. Uh, Romania, I know you need your fuel, so I don't want to use you. Greece? Ah, I don't know. I love Greek fuel. Um, yeah, you guys do that. You guys just hurry up. Kick him out. We want Taranto as well. Actually, I can't request any of France's divisions. No, never. Oh, I can. Give me like 30 of you guys. Wasn't able to conscript them, but you know what? This will be very nice. And this is going to help you and me, France. We're buddies now. Whether you like it or not. Actually, you're guarding your own area. That's really nice. 38, 39. Yeah, we're almost there. We're almost there. Good. That actually will help out. That actually will be very, very nice. You guys, ah, nice little encirclement. Eight divisions. Beautiful. You guys are doing all right on the line, frankly. You guys should probably be able to win. Oh, no wonder nothing's going on. Um, yeah, not bad. I mean, they're still attacking the line like crazy. Pretty much everywhere we need to be, we can hold. So, no issues there. Are we building any more refineries? I could use a few more refineries. Uh, get Poznan. Get that area. And throw in one more nuclear reactor. Because I'm... Mm, starting to run out of space here a little bit. Manpower is looking pretty nice. Pretty darn nice. Mm, ah. Ah, Bulgaria. Oh, we can get more work. Propaganda. I don't really need it, though, at the moment. Region-wide? Sure. Anything else? Anything interesting? Uh-oh. Um. Okay, that's interesting. You're in Turkey. Why are you in Turkey? That doesn't make too much sense. That's okay, though. Ah, good. Let's take a quick look at the losses. 300,000. Makes sense. Versus four-ish. Almost four. Good, 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 good. Thanks. I know you're slow. You're, you're quite literally metal behemoths. Ah, uh, behemoths. Super mutant behemoths are interesting. But that's okay. Hmm. Ah, and there it goes. Yugoslavia. Beautiful. Just beautiful. If you guys could, like, all come, like, here, that would be great. Just go ahead and attack, guys. Yeah, we won't win every place, but that's okay. Oh, you guys are actually over here, which means I'm going to throw you as another field marshal over there. No, as a field marshal over here. We want to finish off Spain. Because we don't have that many divisions over here. Ah, Dictatorial Sinkyang has been defeated. Japan, you're not looking great. Not looking bad. But having the Japanese in the two-front war against Russia, not a bad idea. Really, not a bad idea. Uh... We're holding on with two ports. We actually built two ports, one close to Mimel, and one next... Actually, on both sides, opposite sides of Königsberg, which is nice. Tanks. You're getting attacked, and that's okay with me. I really don't care. Just go ahead and attack down here if you can. Follow it up, and then you take you off, and you move down that way. They are attacking me like crazy. Why are they attacking me so hard? I know they have a lot of manpower. They should have at least a decent amount of equipment, but... The line isn't extremely weak. Oh! Oh yeah, so I guess these guys got crushed. Last time we got cut off in Odessa and... Setatea Alba. So, hmm. Interesting. Uh, don't remember forcing you to attack. Oh, we might have claimed that. We might have actually won that tile, but we might have just lost it. Help them out down there, guys. Thank you. Good. Oh, that's a lot of divisions attacking. That's nice. Um, to save on manpower... 
I already got rid of all my divisions I was making. Okay, that makes sense. Oh, we're getting navally invaded. That's why I need those divisions down there. Oh. Is there any Toronto? Yeah, if you do that, that would be great. Oh. Uh, convoy, thank you. Come on, please take it. And there we go. Awesome. Now, I could throw you on the other side of the front. Eh, they are attacking me like crazy. I kind of don't mind it like this if they're just going to keep wailing themselves against my line. What happens if I do this? And I'll return two of these divisions to you. That's the best we can do for now. Hmm, I got some German cop here too as well. Very nice, very nice. Just, why are you attacking me like crazy, man? Uh, let's see, go ahead and not move. Come down here. And we'll do something like that. Get down to open. Actually, without you. I love pausing the game so much. Ah. Oh, good. Good, good, good. Right, Pink? Yeah, take a nap. Take a nap, man. Awesome. Without you, and then you'll move down here. That will be glorious. Ooh. Nice. Not bad. Keep thinking of those convoys. With the help of some of our bombers, we can help attack the Republican Spanish Navy. You guys are doing okay. Oh, are you? You're down here already? Some of you are. That was fast. Holy cow. Hmm. They have a single division holding there. Let's wait for most of our divisions to show up, and then we'll attack Spain. This is going to, be, this is going to look like one heck of a weird EU when we're done here. Nice. Come on, we got to get open. Yeah, they keep attacking me. I can't get divisions down here. Huh. Good. Good, good. Just gotta keep an eye on fuel. Oh, are we actually losing a fight? Maybe? Oh no, we actually pushed through the Pyrenees. Our allies are doing pretty darn well, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, if you're down here, I mean, I'm not gonna tell you to not attack, I suppose. Where are you guys at? You are already down here as well. So you come right there. Von Bock, don't really want to replace you probably with Runstedt. Oh, but maybe I do. Oh, but yes, I do. You know what? If you can do well, guys, I'm not going to say no. Uh, there's a division over here who has no orders. Or something. There you are. Nice. Oh, actually, the fr that's why I like the French Navy. They can be very useful. Very, very useful. Romania, no worries about the losses. No worries about them. You know, things happen. Oh, you're actually attacking. Oh, we're attacking too. Maximilian? Oh, uh, sure, I guess. Yeah, don't, you don't, 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 please. No, 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 no. Let's yeah, see, so we've lost 350. Uh, the tanks actually were defeated. Hmm. Well, it'll help if we have actually all of the tanks down here. We're gonna get to Gleiwitz. Gleiswitz? Gleiwitz. That will be good. We can constantly get attacked. That's okay, because I want to cut off all these divisions. My goodness, guys. My goodness. So many losses for you. Glorious, glorious losses. Also, uh, someone recommended yesterday, or a few days ago, whenever this video goes up, that I should try a campaign where I keep the normal army, do whatever I want with the army, do whatever I want with the navy, but, but, I should try a campaign where if I want to use an air force, they have to be jet bombers only. Oh, the UK is not alone in seeing that the rise, the threat rising in Central Europe. Um, okay. So, that'd be interesting. Maybe I'll try that sometime. Jet, if I want an Air Force, including carrier planes, I have to uh, use only jet planes. That's interesting. Um, I'll think about it. Sounds like fun, but my goodness, look at look at this. Just the, the destruction of their own army. They can't win. I mean, they're, they're causing problems for my fuel, maybe, but other than that, the Poles are going hard at it. Um... Oh, nice. Yeah, just get everyone down there now. That just makes more sense. 
Uh, what else do we want? 1944. It's almost 1945. Our industry is almost completely done. Awesome. Our uh, engineering is almost completely done. Awesome. Fighter stuff? Yeah, I'll do that because we are actually lacking quite a few fighters. 38. That's not bad. We definitely need more artillery though. Holy cow. Artillery. Yeah, we just... Uh, maybe it would be a good idea to make more... At least one more thing of this for now. Oops. Yeah, make, eh, make two lines of that. That's not bad. Ah, once Republican Spain falls, it will be a great addition to the European Union. I love it. Heinz, you're going to get, get a, hopefully, a lot of experience by doing this. It's good. Actually, let's take a quick look at casualties again. So they've lost 4 million. 3.1 to me. Uh, I know they're at war with Japan as well, but we can't see that war. I would love to see how many losses they've suffered from Japan. 1944, support companies. Let's get some better logistics. So supply usage goes down, so I can save a little bit on fuel. Save 15% or more on fuel. God, the tanks are down here. Could get Gleivitz, but maybe if we attacked here instead. Um, as long as the infantry holds, that's, that's pretty much key, because I don't want to lose these divisions. All right, get our guys, get ready to go. Prussia is still Prussia. We haven't lost too much. Um, we still have a ton of land forts around here, so that's going to be important. Yeah, let's let's take a quick look. Why not? Current wars. Oh crud! Oh, oh, I thought I wasn't recording stuff or keeping a stopwatch on. Okay, so we're about halfway through this video, maybe. Um, Soviet German war. Of course, that's what we can always see. Manchu Swedish war. 1.6 million. Okay, interesting. Oh, they're war with the U.S. It's two. That's right. And then our faction, which doesn't involve me, France, Romania, or Hungary, have lost 300,000. Holy cow. How is that possible? Jeez. The Allies have lost 2.36 million. All right. The U.S. has lost oh, roughly half a million. Raj has lost quite a few, which is expected. The U.K. has lost 600,000. Um, the Lithuanian Manchu War thousand from them. Japan is, so Japan has inflicted almost half a million casualties to the Soviet Union while well, they've suffered 110,000. Wow, that's pathetic. Wow, good job, Japan. Not bad. Really so far. Next up, uh, let's get some more improved infantry equipment. Three. That's something I usually don't ever really consciously think about too much. So, that'll be good. Why don't you attack down here? Give them more force attack. That should help out at least a little bit. Where are my divisions? Ah, there you are. I ask, and you show up. Ah, Herman Hoff. Hello there. Hope you're having a good day. Ah, yes. Crush them. Crush them like the dogs they are. A Soviet or common turn sandwich? I think so. There's only three tiled, but that's like... Is that one? That's, that's four plus two is six. Ten, twelve, fifteen, sixteen, twenty-two. Twenty-two plus six is twenty-eight divisions. I can do math. At least when I have my German coffee, I can. Beautiful. Beautiful. Just make sure you don't abandon that tile immediately. Guys. Oh, no, you're still getting down here. Okay. Whew. Good. Ah, uh, Breslau. Uh, Breslau is our territory. Yeah, they took our territory. Oh, Belgium. No, thanks. It's only one division. Not really interested in that too much. War bonds. War bonds aren't bad the first time you take them. After you take them, like, once, they cost more and more. They lower your war support, I think, or something. I don't exactly remember, but, you know, it's not the best. If you want to move, you can attack that way. It's only 12 divisions you can kill, but, you know, it is what... Oh, you already killed them. Go ahead and give them the juice from this direction. Give them the juice. The good German juice. Uh, good... There more? Good. That's, yeah, I don't want really to get involved up here. The supply is pretty bad. How's Spain doing? That's a good question to ask, actually. How is Spain doing? Spain is becoming a little bit more French. And that's okay. You guys, take out Barcelona. There's only six divisions there, and we do have air superiority. Spain will fall like all the others. And I kind of figured this would happen, seeing as, uh... Oh. Our French divisions are down here, too. Hmm... Not particularly good, I suppose. 
That's why we gotta cut them off everywhere. Oh, Romania's looking kind of weird. As well as Greece. Ah, coffee. Sorry if I slurped for that. Sorry. Um, cool, Breslau. That would be great to get. Destroy all those enemy divisions. Uh, even though the Soviets still have way too many. Well, it's not just Soviets of Polish people, too. Upwards of almost 600? This is going to take a while to do. They have almost 115 in Poland. Maybe? It's a pretty decent amount. Yep, 27 divisions. And this is how you kill them off. You let them into your territory, you encircle them, and go. Slurp. Mmm. Mmm. I love communism for breakfast. Communists are tasty. <sighs> Just, I'm taking my time with this war, if you can't tell. But happy 1945, everyone. Uh, we probably won't be home by Christmas, but it won't be too bad. It won't go on until 1950. Probably. Ah, beautiful. 4.72 million. That's not high enough. Mm, we could try to break through to Prussia again. But let's break through somewhere else. The south has always been a problem, but the supply down here is so bad, I don't think I want to engage them down here. But that'll be good to raise this up first. Nope. Nope. Mm, I think just Poland. More Poland. More, more, more Poland. And I'm eyeing what could be a tasty Polish street. Uh, oh, we're still trying to find convoys. That's good. Do we have radar around here? That actually could be very useful. Put some radar in Damzig as well. That would help find some enemy ships. They got a lot of mines in there. Interesting, interesting. This is going fine. Uh, Republican Spain is going okay. We've lost 400,000 some. Republican Spain is going to lose soon. Just good stuff all around. Good stuff. Valencia. Three divisions. Very good. And soon to be no divisions. Awesome. Oh, well, guys, you don't really need to attack that direction. That's not a pro gamer move, some would say. Now, can we use four super heavy tanks? They're not exactly at full strength yet. They are missing a few of their tanks uh, to attack here. And if that's possible, it's kind of hard to see. Can we move up that way? And move up that way. And then do another small circlement that way. Let's hope so. Let's give them a little bit more push immediately. And we are immediately getting a higher... Wow, number. Okay. The battle ends so fast, I can't finish my talking. And that's okay with me. That's a-okay. Oh, what's going on over here? Someone trying to navally invade Mimel? Oh, no. The Danes are doing something. Why did I build Kernsburg up to a level 10 port? Or fort? That was maybe a bad idea. Oh well. Ah, oh, tanks lead the way. Keep going, guys. You're doing great. Heinz, you're level 6. And I love it. Erich? Greatness. Awesome. Oh, and you know what? It's not a great idea, but go ahead and try to help attack them here. Uh, actually, I'll take you guys help attack here. Yeah, this is the exact how we want. It's a small, it's a small encirclement. You know, we can't always do these giant, massive, beautiful encirclements. But uh, stuff like this, it's all right to do. Uh, don't go that way. If anything, you can tell it's lagging when I can't stop the attack immediately. You know what? You help out right here. Good. Good. Oh, wait, these are the divisions I wanted to make with Hungary. Um, I'm noticing you maybe lost two divisions down here, Wilhelm List. So, go ahead and do that. You want to help crush these guys as fast as possible, do that. And we made a very tiny encirclement. It's only ten divisions or so. It's not the most impressive I've ever done. Ah, but there goes Republican Spain. Nice. Kill them off, please. Oh, France, you... Do you want to unite, you know, France and Spain into one country again? I might object to that, guys. Alright, so now I can actually throw you on the front line. 
If that's a case. Huh. Hmm. I'm just trying to do this side, because I don't want supply to be extremely terrible. You know, I'm going to guard the southern front with these guys first for now. I know supply's bad, but it's a necessary evil. Tanks, you did a great job. I know I've, I've used you and abused you quite a bit, and that's okay. And I'm going to continue to use and abuse you, as the enemies are trying to sneak into our lines. Ah. Casualties, 7.05. Beautiful. Still no fighters. Probably just trying to replace the fighters that we've lost so far. We need 80 super heavy tanks. We need a ton of artillery. Holy cow. Oh, why do I only have two? No wonder we're not getting any tanks. Holy goodness. Turkey, I'm already borrowing a lot of chromium. So I'm going to ask for a little bit more. Oh, we have another light cruiser. Beautiful. Tasty. And, you know what, for these guys, I'm going to keep you kind of in reserve. I don't think I really need you to push too hard anywhere at the moment. I would love to send you to North Africa, but that could wait for now. I'm going to split you up, actually. Take one army, keep them from, like, here to Madrid-ish. A little hook type of deal. You guys come down here to Italy, come back and help. And then you guys do Southern France. Should be okay. It's always good to have reserve armies. Ah, nice. Tanks, you're doing okay. 0.6 a day, that's not bad. Hmm. Yeah, so I want some mechanized as well. That would be fun to use on these super heavy tanks. I've researched all this naval stuff, but, uh... I'm not gonna really use it too much. Do we just make something? Maybe? Maybe not? <sighs> Another light cruiser? Another light cruiser. Looks like a 1940s uh, light cruiser. You know what? Go ahead and repair for now. That would be okay with me. Um, I'm sure Poland now has no... Oh, they have barely any manpower. The Soviets, they're still struggling. The Japanese, they are struggling, to say the least. And I, I love that I still have Southeast Asia somehow. Beautiful. Oh, and I don't want to forget. You never know if you might get navally invaded somewhere. Good. You know what? Just do all this. We'll make something called the Atlantic Wall, maybe? Maybe? It's, it's an idea. It's an idea. To prevent any Soviets from coming in. Exactly. Exactly. France, I love what you've done so far. Romania, I really don't like how you're killing off your own manpower. So I'm going to make sure that you don't do that. And spare some of your men's lives. Oh, wait. What the heck? Oh. Why are you... Are you down... Wait, there was a division around here, like in Africa or something. Mmm, look at that. Holy cow, guys, guys, Romania. Romania, why you do this? You're out of manpower on service by requirement. Oh, Romania. You're poor men. Nice. Dockyards are okay. Oh, do we have some of this? Yes, mechanized. That'll be lovely. I think I gave my guys enough time to prepare themselves. So we will attack up here. Oh, I should probably select them first. Everyone attack that way. Take you off and attack that area next. Give them extra supplies. They should be able to break through not too with too much difficulty. Send one of you guys this way too. Ooh, yay. It's not so much about taking land right now. That's not the goal. The goal is to crush the enemy's armies. Land is secondary. Destroying the enemy is the primary target. Um, des Emergency factory conversion? Well, we don't really need that. Let's get some region-wide industrial integration. Oh, we immediately beat them here. Good. Another small encirclement. Small but necessary. That is how you defeat the Soviets. Go ahead and immediately launch an invasion this way. You guys do that. You guys do that. Good, good, good. You can send probably one division that way. Send that tank this way, too. But they're not going to move in. Good. Oh, my God. Who is attacking on the line? Holy smokerinos. 
So you guys are over here. You're not really in the right theater anymore. Or was it Steiner? Steiner was okay. Yeah, Steiner's okay. I want him in the north. You guys are all here, I guess. Good. Let's see. So. We can meet in the middle. Can I request check divisions? I don't think I can. No, I cannot. So, Hungary. I'm going to take all your forces so we don't have any sort of supply issues. And go to the coasts. Just just leave, please. Oh, British Raj, you better not do anything fancy like that. Uh, Romania. I'm going to re uh, request some more, some more of your divisions just because I don't want the supply issues down here. There you go. Oh, Germany looked a little weird there. Cool, cool, cool. Go take Toronto. Tanks. Hmm. We get attack here next. And we'll do something like that. Well, now we're going to try to get to Prussia. Prussia is German. Absolutely. Ah. Uh, Guys, don't. Why are you canceling your non aggression pact? I'm not raising too much world tension. The Soviet Union has raised 79 world tension. Um, I'm just trying to defend myself here. Uh, yeah, go ahead and do that. If we do that, we can probably get to Plock fairly okay. And immediately send in these seven divisions to help in reserve. And then immediately come to Plock as well. Ah, uh, yes. We could use that. Very good. Artillery is doing much better than earlier. Super heavy tanks, we're, we're doing better on that too. Uh, fighters. Well, we actually have a small reserve of extra fighters. Nice. Oh, the infantry are not doing well there. That's why I should have my tanks go first, but whatever. Whatever. Ah, uh, there they are. Some extra fighters. Nice. There you go. Tanks are absolutely necessary. And you know what? They can't win. Tell them to hit them even harder. Good. Good, good, good. Better Mountaineers? Sure, why not? Level 4, level 6. Good. How's this uh, motor is doing? Strength 47. Um, now they're up here. Strength is 42. Oh, we're not winning. Huh. 33. Well, if we can't win there, then let's hold immediately. And we shall do this next. We shall attack again, but starting with the tanks. Uh, technology. Maintenance companies, that would be great. Yeah. With all those divisions that were here earlier, we wouldn't be able to break through with infantry leading the way. Not a smart idea. That's okay. I want to at least free Prussia by the time this episode is over. Okay, so our allies are trying to attack like crazy. And they have some very okay-ish results. Yeah, they take land, but they're losing all their men in the process. That's not ideal. That is very much not ideal. Supply is so bad down here in Moldova. Bessarabia, keep building that stuff up. Uh, refineries are still a good idea to build. The threat of the lack of fuel is not good. I just closed out the wrong thing. Where are those divisions? Oh, Hungary. No, you don't have the gold thing around you. Oh, come on. Guys. Guys. Man, come on. Can't you just give it up? Apparently not. Yeah, taking over the river is never a good idea. So, you know what? We tried. I tried super hard for that. And if that's the case, I'm still going to go for Prussia. Can I just use my infantry to do this? No. Maybe. That's a that's a possibility. No. Mm, let's put you down here. Maybe. It's definite maybe. Yeah. Send the tanks down here. That'll be good. Oh, 
Oh, here's a 40 combat with division. Oh, this this is what the AI made? Anti-tank? Signal companies? Oh, heck yeah, let's try that. That sounds like fun, but I got nowhere else to put you. Put you right there, though. Even though I'm not, I'm not even really using you guys. Interesting. Interesting. Do we take the towel yet? No, but we might just be able to. Yeah, we should be able to take that. That'll be good. Hold it across the river. And we do have a nuclear bomb if we need to use it. But that means we need air superiority. And you know what? The first target should always be in any campaign. Uh, you guys do this. And if you can do some of that, try it. You know, that's always help helpful. Uh, you guys come over here. Let me deploy 200 more of this before I see if we have any more fighters. Uh, we really have no more fighters. Do we get any other type of planes? Because I really don't want to make any strategic bombers. Yeah, I'm going to have to get some. Mm, hello there, strategic bomberinos. Nice. Yeah, we're going to have to wait a while for these super heavy tanks, and that's okay. That is A-OK. -okay. Losses. Oh, not bad. Yeah, Soviets aren't doing well. Uh, hungry. You're having a time there, I suppose. So you guys are in the south. At, or where are you guys? Holy cow, the game lags hard now. No, you're not. You are in the south. And you guys, you're just kind of there. So you guys, top leader, is in the south. Can I drag you over here? No, I cannot. That sucks. So you guys are in the north. So the top one is in the south. The bottom one is... The second one is in the... North, which doesn't make any sense. I should have organized this a little bit better. That's okay. Just kind of hang on for now, tanks. I suppose if you really wanted to, you could probably push them out of here. Probably. I mean, we have air superiority when we do this, so that's nice. It's very, very nice. Soviet losses. Yeah, so They still have so much manpower. They do have less than 600 divisions, at least for now. Good, Good job, tanks. Good job. Anything, I will put you all right there because the next encirclement will come close to Gleivitz, hopefully. And how's the north doing? Uh, it's actually almost a straight line. That's not bad. Not bad whatsoever. Ah, uh, French divisions are doing well, it looks like, to a degree. We still own Syria. Ireland says we want to be maybe aggressive. Japan is doing well, the Empire of Manchuko. What the heck? Empire. Five-year plan. National defensive state, huh? Alright, another one of you guys. I'll uh, just throw you on to that group, I guess. Oh, are you guys actually going to take this tile? You might be able to, actually. Yeah, you might be able to take this and make Königsberg a... like an island surrounded by German territory, surrounded by Soviet territory. That's not bad. Nice. Awesome. That's actually not a bad idea. Oh, oh, and a hotly contested vote. A small majority in the Australian Parliament decided that the country should leave the British Empire. But they just joined the Allies. Um, they have a constitutional committee. Oh, okay, so we have a lot of these divisions. Good. Coasts come down there. All of you, minus you, shall form the army group there. And you know what? Get rid of my own divisions. I could save on manpower. And you guys come there. And then... Coast Guards. Come right there. That'll be good. Awesome. We should be able to take Königsberg eventually. That's, that'll be very nice. As I'm I'm just just waiting right now to get more super heavy tanks. Because we, you know, we, used, we used them. We abused them. And I still want to use them. You guys should be able to do this. See, oh, we're taking over a river again. Always over a river. Carousel bombing, very nice. Let's now get infiltration bombing next. That'd be good. Small little attacks. Small, small, small little attacks. Oh, supply down here is so bad. Guys, you need to put logistic companies on. This is something I always do because they're so important in my mind. It's always good to have logistic companies. And you know what? Immediately send half of your divisions down this way. Help attack, really, but you're really there to help hold the line. Good. Let's go and get some more region-wide stuff. Not bad. 
Good, good, good. I want to attack Hernixburg, but they have level 10 forts there. The north are getting attacked. The Soviet war machine is coming back online. It is April 24th, so the snow should be melting now. Or should have already melted, really. Um, should be able to take this. Yeah, I don't know why it's lagging so hard. I mean, I haven't annexed that many people. The more people you annex, the less divisions get produced, the less there is a drag on speed. Holy cows. Did someone just get released or something? Yeah, between this episode and the next, I'm probably going to... Grease. Grease. Um, I see something here. Guys? Hello! The Netherlands no doesn't exist anymore. I wasn't expecting this. Hmm. We have fascist Netherlands in our faction. Ah, uh, that's actually not the worst thing that could happen. Because if they break away once the war is over, I have a pretty good justification to go to war with them. I could kick them out, kick them out of the alliance, which would be good. Um, we didn't take the tile. Are you kidding me? Come on. I know you don't have a lot of tanks in your group, but this shouldn't be a problem whatsoever. Really shouldn't be. Breslau, Eastern Germany, dockyards. Yes, maybe so. Super heavy battleship hulls. Can I upgrade you any further? Yes, I can. Anti-air. Did I get any more? Nope. Mm. That's really the only thing you can change besides that in the engine. But I don't have enough army XP. Or naval XP. Sure, let's make another one that I'll never use. Yes, thank you. Good. Good luck making that. Good luck. One of you bad boys, honestly, I'm going to start stop making you guys. Don't really need you around here. Uh, yeah. I have enough divisions. I just need to be able to hold them. Alright, you guys. I want to make at least one more encirclement before I end the video. Oh, man. If we could all get, like, down here, that'd be amazing. Help attack that direction. Encircle all these guys. Crush them, defeat them. All that good stuff. Memel, I mean, you only have one state there that we could probably take out. 415 factories is pretty nice. We definitely won't be home by Christmas to disappoint. I'm sure some people, but that's okay. You know, happens. <sighs> North Transylvania, that's okay. It's really just Moldova and Bessarabia that are having the problems. Guys, please don't attack. I say that as I'm currently attacking as well. Give them more strength. Oh, we are taking over a river. That's not a good idea. But as long as they're, all the surrounding divisions are distracted, we should be able to beat these guys up here. Okay. I love it. Oh, if I get to crack out, that'd be awesome. But Kiels, Kielsi would be just delightful to get. Because then we can cut all these divisions off. The more divisions you can cut off, the better. Let's give our guys a little bit... I want as much planning as possible on these soldiers. Um, this is looking good. Actually, they expanded out just a tiny bit. That's nice. Anything else around here? Uh, we're not winning those attacks. Kind of expect, expect that. Romania really wants Bukovina. 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 Uh, losses. Super heavy tanks, we're doing a little better on. Fighters, we're slowly getting more. Artillery, we no longer have a depth. We actually have quite a bit of artillery, which is nice. I don't really want to lower that too much. But I do need more planes, more fighters. And this will reduce our dependency on tungsten just by a wee bit. Just by a wee bit. Good. They are trying to stockpile more soldiers here, and that's okay. Um, planes. I'm going to actually throw some more fighters, if possible, on my tank divisions. Oh, actually, you? Split in half. Ooh, good hospitals. Very good. That'll come in handy. Yeah, I really have no more extra fighters. I need more fighters. You know what? I don't like doing this, but sometimes you gotta do it. That'll be good. Do that, do that, do that. Better recon? Sure, because why not? And then, you guys... You're pretty comp... Jeez, that's so big. Oh, the supply isn't very good. Uh, immediately begin attacking, then. See if you can do that. Send in the infantry. Yes, it's just across the river. 
bad, bad, bad idea. But you know what? I don't want to lose all of my supply. And the sooner we do it, the faster we can take him out and not lose supply. Uh, you guys, you could probably just hold there. And just in case, this is a means to an end. I will lose a few soldiers doing this. But I do not want these guys to move. I want my infantry in there as well as my tanks. Come on, move in faster. You're almost there. The arrow, up. Oh, the tanks made it. Good. Good. Go ahead and hold. Ah, oh, Klusher. Ah, oh, infantry expert. Yeah, that's, that's pretty useful. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. Now, you guys will hold a line like that for now. Kiels. Can't really increase your infrastructure right now. Actually, you know what? I don't want them to do that. <clears throat> I forget exactly. Oh, right there. I want you to reform the line down here so I can send my tanks to take out these bad boys. That's what I want. Nice. Good. If we could take these guys out right now, that would be probably actually really, really useful. But send the tank immediately to Krakow and then to Ketavis. Artillery did really well on that. Truck drawn stuff, anti air stuff. You know what? We'll do it. Why? Because why not? Why the heck not? Good. Uh, do not move. You, I literally, literally cannot have afford you to move. As uh, so we're chugging along here, chugging, chugging, chugging. The tanks are moving down to take Krakow. Good. Good, good, good. Come on, guys. I've got my finger down on the plus button. It is lagging quite a bit. Immediately attack him in this direction. I don't know how many divisions this is, but it's at least 30. Probably close to more like 40, really. Pause it real quick. You guys are doing great. Don't go anywhere... Take out Catavis. I want to take away their supply as much as possible. Nice. The northern province has fallen. The infantry are attacking Gleivitz, which is good. Oh, snap. That's not good. That's really not good. Send you guys this way. Uh, the Dutch Rishk is here as well. Send you up north. Our attacks on Catavis are not doing extremely great right now. And that's okay. Oh, no. They might be able to get in here. Hold the line. Hold the line. Get up there. I need you to continue to attack. Glavitz, come on. Oh, we took another tile. Look at all these divisions. Let them suffer. Attack there. You guys immediately attack here. Um, you're not moving. You are not allowed to move. I don't care what's happening out the rest of the front. You are not allowed to move. Good, good, good. All these divisions are going to go bye-bye. This is the encirclement that we wanted. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Take the tile. Tanks, you take forever to move. Oh, we already have divisions there. Good, good. Oh, my goodness. You see this? Oh, oh yeah. That was... Oh, yeah. That was good stuff, man. That was really good stuff. But... Unfortunately, I've spent too long on this episode today, but I hope you enjoyed it. My goodness. Um, we suffered half a million casualties. France has lost quite a few. We've lost 4.62 million so far. The enemies have lost up to 9 million, with the Poles and the Soviets taking the most. But anyways, guys, Mongolia is almost dead. <clears throat> France has invaded Finland. The fascist Dutch invaded Leningrad. And overall... We're doing pretty darn well. So, hope you enjoyed it. Like I said earlier, guys, if you did, maybe leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and I will catch you all tomorrow as we continue to, quite literally, destroy the lives of our enemies. Thanks for watching, and have a great, great day.